She makes us want to holla because she's so amazing. This Juno Award winning artist known as one of Canada's greatest voices. If you need any proof, come on, just listen to the brand new album. It is called Meaning to Tell Ya. Please welcome the uber talented Molly Johnson. Hey, thanks Hi. for having me. Listen, we were just holding this up and you say your new album, the cover, you call it what? I call that Nicki Minaj Pink. It's Nicki Minaj That's Nicki Pink. Pink. Nicki Pink. Loving my girl. You know what though, the feel on this one, I'm just looking at this, you're smiling, your hair is flowing, and this is kind of the album that you wanted to make for years. It is. I, I just got to work with the Grammy winning producer, Larry Klein, and that was a dream. It was a master class in how to make a record with that guy. And he's worked with the likes of some big names. Tracy Chapman, Nora Jones, married to Joni Mitchell. Yeah. I mean, you should have gotten a Grammy for that. <laughs> <laughs> but that's, it's amazing. And so how, how did that collaboration come together and what did that mean for you with your creative juices? You know, as, as a lot of things, it sort of came through a friend, through a friend, and there he was. Yeah. And uh, he came up to Toronto from Los Angeles, and I put together the A team of a band. Yeah. I just got my favorite best guys, and we got into a room in downtown Toronto, and we took five days, and it was awesome. You said, let's just do it. Let, well, that's, that's what you do. You do it. And you got pretty much carte blanche with this one, right? Like I certainly did. Universal's been absolutely awesome in just... Here's a chunk of Molly, money, Molly. Go make a great record. When will someone say, have, okay, a, have a chunk I of can money? Do that. <laughs> I, that's never a bad phrase. Have a chunk of mo money, Molly. Yeah. There you go. Here's a chunk of money. Go, go make a great record. I love it. Now, I of hope course, I did. You, you did. It's fabulous. So Thank you so it's incredible. much. And you've got a ton of followers, of course, from the jazz world. But you'd say this album, you wouldn't necessarily categorize it as jazz. You've got some blues, funk, a bit of mix yeah, into everything. Yeah, you know, right? it's a soul record. You know, mm -hmm. we wrote it. I wrote a bunch of these songs with the great Canadian drummer Davide Dorenzo. Uh, writing with a drummer is very exciting what and they, interesting. With way a drummer, to work. They, they bring you something different. He brought like me different... beats, but he's he's an awesome musician, Davide. So it wasn't he's not just a drummer. He can play some piano, like like great musicians. They can play a few things. So we, you know, we came with some beats, some tracking. Yeah. I was actually in Cuba. Bad weather. Wrote a bunch of lyrics mm -hmm. in my hotel room, <laughs> came back, made a record, yay! It's unreal. So, I've got to say, so we've got um, seven original tracks and yeah. then three covers. Covers, yeah. yeah. And your first one released is uh, Inner City Blues, Marvin Gaye. I know. What, now, why this one for your first one? You know, Marvin wrote those lyrics in 1970, and they resonate still so very deeply mm. uh, today. Unfortunately, it's about crime increasing you know, police checking, all kinds of issues that we deal with today. Yeah. Marvin captured in 1970 an amazing song. And, uh, you know, I've covered some of the greats, Billie Holiday, some of the greats. I was a little intimidated by Marvin Gaye, <laughs> but I just, you know, the message was so clear and strong just to sing it straight through and as straight as possible amazing. really, really made that track. So very relevant today. And, and you know, you walk away with a you're humming some of these beats when you listen to these songs. You can't get away from it. And that's Thank a good you. thing, that's Molly. That's a great thing. That's a really good thing. It's a great thing. I've got to quickly mention, because you are such a strong supporter of, of course, local talent yes, here I in am. Toronto. We've got a, a great community. Anybody who knows about the Kensington Music Jazz Festival knows that hundreds of musicians come out. And that's it's right. happening again in September. It is September 14, 15, 16 this year in Kensington Market, right at the end of TIFF. Yeah. We kind of piggyback onto TIFF Everybody with a bunch way. of crazy jazz <laughs> musicians and just really solid musicians. J, jazz with a very small J <laughs> in Kensington Market. It's super fun. Oh my gosh, check that out. Check out Molly. Meaning to tell you drops this Friday. Breakfasttelevision.ca for more. Congratulations on all your Thanks, success. Sweetie. Thanks, sweetie. Thanks for having amazing. me. I love it. All right.